hello my lovelies and welcome back to another video i hope you had a, a wonderful christmas and a fabulous new year so this is a video i did before christmas one of my festive sets but i thought you'd still like to see it anyway so i've got this one and one other that i did which are a little bit festive but hey ho that's all i've got at the minute <laughs> so this is daydreamer which is a premix glitter by glitter bells it's not necessarily a festive one it's just fits lovely with that time of year it's silvery sparkly it's got little tiny stars in it it's very very beautiful it's a little bit like pluto but it has a different um shine to it different color really when you have it in under the light it shines differently this one's more goldy I would say even though it's silver it shines a bit of gold if that makes sense it is gorgeous as you can see I'm just doing a stripe down the middle and I'm just going over that now with my glass slippers to encapsulate it and to do the color block you've got to make sure that it's the same height all the way down the nail so that when you come to file you don't have any dips and you lose patches of color we've all been there when we first start color blocking <laughs> you have to make sure it's quite thick but not too thick just give it a go you can do it i know you can so on my thumb is uh in here on on my thumb i am wearing pink snow which was my favorite from the festive premix glitters I was obsessed with it so I used it on myself so now I've finished that finger well finished that stripe for now I'm coming on to the ring finger and I am doing a nail bed and I'm using nude blush cover which is my new favorite even though it's been out forever I've had it forever but as most nail techs know, you have your go-to cause and I always just use Peach Bell Soft, Pink Bell Cover, Peach Bell Cover. I have about four or five that are just my go-tos. And um, I just thought, you know, I'm going to give this one a go and I am obsessed with it. It's the most beautiful colour, most beautiful cover pink. So now this is my new favourite. <laughs> and... Um, there's another one that I've been using a lot as well. Can't remember what it's called off the top of my head, but I'm sure you'll see it in one of my videos. And then this pink here is just all the all of the daydream glitter. So as you can see, it is just stunning. It just sparkles beautifully. And then I think I also come over it a little bit with your so icy but I only use it really yet. I think I use it a little bit after that and it's more for the snowflakes that are in that one. So maybe a tiny bit of the actual glitter, but it's mostly this one, Daydream. And then just a tiny bit of You're So Icy because I really wanted the snowflakes out of that one. There, I'm using the tiny little bit there. And then I think I'm just squashing a snowflake between my fingers so it sits on the nail better. Because a lot of the Christmas ones, like the one I'm wearing on my thumbs, um, all have little snowflakes in them. So I just stole some of the snowflakes out of that one. So I'm just doing, like, just going about three quarters up the nail here because I'm going to ombre this one. I just love how sparkly this one is. It's so sparkly. And as with a lot of the Glitter Bells premix glitters, there's loads of different sizes and chunks and there's just a bit of everything in each pot. They've just released loads of new ones, which I have got on the way. And I was actually thinking of doing like a swatch video because they've released um, loads of new Hema Free gel polishes, which are insanely beautiful. I've actually got one on my nails at the minute called Lilac Queen, which is like a two-tone sparkly gorgeousness. And then obviously they brought out loads of new powders. Um, 
the premix glitters they've got um, a wedding collection and some more crushes so i was thinking of doing a swatch video if you would like to see that comment below and i will do that for you so as you can see i am now just filing this smile line to do the french nail and then i'll also file the this one <laughs> nice and straight keep the file as straight as possible and push against the acrylic not down onto the nail like i just did then because i just bent the tip see we all make mistakes just making sure that tip is okay and i haven't damaged it luckily i hadn't and then i'm coming in again with that gorgeous gorgeous glitter honestly say what you want about glitter bells but man they can do some beautiful glitters <laughs> like i know i'm an ambassador and i know you probably think oh you know she has to say this but i would never use something if it was gonna make my work bad ever and truthfully i use all glitter bells because a they literally have everything these days and b they're just amazing so like Annabelle and Elliot, they knew that their gel polish range wasn't as good as they would have liked it to have been. They took on board everybody's um, advice and, you know, just what everyone was saying. And they took that on board and they've created this whole new range of gel polish. And man, they are perfection. Like... I've not met one person yet that doesn't love them. They are the best gel polish I've ever used and I just can't recommend them enough. And I would never recommend anything that I thought was of a poor standard ever. So yeah, I might be a Glitter Bells ambassador, but I will not recommend anything to you unless I truly believed it was worth recommending. And uh, as you can see here, I'm just coming in now. I just ombre on the... Um, index now i'm just coming down the sides of this stripey one and don't worry if you go over the top of it because you're going to file that off anyway you get to see that in a minute which is just unbelievably satisfying <laughs> but yeah just give you know give the glitter ball stuff a go if you've not tried it they have um distributors all over the world now they have um the nail throne who is in uh, that's sarah's nail secret she's in canada and distributes to the whole of the United States, as far as I am aware. And then they've also got Lisa, who is in Germany. They've got people all over now, so you can pretty much get them wherever you are in the world, which is lovely. So I'm just finishing off this nail, just making sure there's enough. And it's nice and thick. Well, as thick as it needs to be for filing because this is obviously car powder and the glass slippers is over the stripe so I don't need to cap it and now I'm coming in with my Cyan K38 e-file it's the mobile one the portable one and I'm using one of the new glitter bells e-file bits and I have to say genuinely I, can, I know I say it all the time it is the best e-file bit I've ever used this one is just a medium safety barrel one um but i have got a few of them now and all of them are amazing uh the extra coarse one takes off acrylic in minutes back down to the clear base just incredible incredible i love them now i'm coming in with the glit bells unbelievable gel in white and i'm just coming round this nail sorry about my dog you can probably hear him in the background he's snoring away and I've also got my youngest son, Harry, laid next to me. Do you want to say hello, Harry? Hello. <laughs> um, so I'm just going around the smile line here and then doing some icy cold drips. I had a bit of a hair there. I'm um, using my Glitter Bells, one of my Glitter Bells stripy brushes for this. God, my dog is so loud. He's half pug, so he snores quite a lot. And does he snore, Harry? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 I'm 
This is why you don't do voiceovers with kids around. They go back to school tomorrow. Woo! And then just around this cuticle area. <coughs> Honestly, what do they say? Don't work with animals and kids. <coughs> And then, yep, yeah, just this last little bit here. And then I'll be coming in with my Glitter Bells Fairy Dust in fine. Just using my old cuticle pusher to pick that up and sprinkle on top. Sure, Sherry. I was actually meant to top coat with shiny and then do this because you don't need to go over the sugared nails um, when you're using the unbelievable gels because there's no tacky coat but mm, I'm an idiot and I forgot so I'm going over the top of the sugared with my Glitter Bells No Wipe Top Coat. How beautiful is this set? I loved it. I can't believe Christmas is over and I don't get to do beautiful Christmas nails anymore. First thing Harry. I'm not even going to attempt to edit this out. It's not even worth it. But this is the end result. And I hope you like them as much as I do. I actually love them. And I've got one more set to put up that was from Christmas. And I hope you like it. And then I'll be back shortly with some newer sets. Bye. Say bye, Harry. Bye.